Hi everybody, it's me Alicia Butler Pierre and today I want to share with you a system that I created for myself that you might also find useful to you in your small business as you're trying to kind of organize your daily accounting activities into a system that's very visual. So what I have here is um, a customized system that I worked with California Closets to design and as you can see there's four different slots or boxes and the bottom unit is simply just a file drawer. So the way it works is whenever I'm out and about throughout the day and I'm out networking and I check my mail and then I come, come back to my office, the first thing I do is I put everything here in this first slot. And I actually have a label on here that says calendar slash correspondence. So this is basically saying any incoming mail or correspondence, it goes into this slot. I then have a calendar system where on a particular day of the week, so for me that happens to be Friday, I go through everything in this particular inbox and I take it out and I just start sorting. So like right here I have the Atlanta Business Chronicle which is a local newspaper where I live and I'll just put this off to the side as a reminder to myself that this is something that I need to read through. But let's say if there are some bills in there or copies of invoices, then that information would then go into the its appropriate slot and then once I'm finished with that, I then determine whether or not it needs to be filed. So another thing that I do, this second slot here is for receipts. And as you can see, again, as I'm out throughout the week or on a daily basis, whenever I come back into my office, first order of business is to place any receipts um, from purchases that I may have made into this particular box. And sometimes what I do when my bookkeeper comes over every Monday morning, she then just takes this pouch and she places all the receipts in there. And that's when she then goes back into our accounting software, which is we use QuickBooks and she just enters that information into QuickBooks. Um, my next box here is for accounts receivable. So this is again a visual reminder to myself to see, well, who owes me money? <laughs> are they on time or are they, have they, you know, is this account past due? Now if it's past due, then again, that's just a visual reminder to myself to actually send some type of letter and work with with them on collecting payment. But let's say if I actually received a check or whatever form of payment, then again I have a pouch here. I just place those payments into this pouch and make the deposit to my bank account, my business bank account. The last slot here is for accounts payable. So what I would do is, again, on a designated day of the week, I just go in this slot, I take everything out, and I just start paying these bills. So as you can see here, this is a bill for AT&T. And once I pay that bill, I just write the amount paid, the date that it was paid, and then my bookkeeper also comes and picks up that information. And then when she brings it back, I then just file it into the necessary place in this file drawer. So there you have it folks, a really quick, simple, easy way of organizing your data. You don't have to go out and spend money trying to build a custom system. You can actually use something like a literature sorter that you can find at Walmart, Target, uh, any office supply store. It usually costs about maybe $10 to $15. But you can use anything, just something that's going to be, uh, that will have a prominent visual place in your office to help you keep everything organized.